Welcome to Fusion 360 Electronics. I'm Ed Robledo from the Fusion 360 family to tell you about the new and improved features in this latest update for Fusion 360. Let's begin with the new place component panel that I'm sure it's going to be one of your favorites. Browsing libraries and finding the correct component for your schematic requires navigating thousands of available components to locate the part you need. Now we've made this much more accessible. The next time you start adding components to your schematic, you're going to notice the do place component panel. We ditched the modal dialog box and replaced it with a unique panel, making it so much easier to pinpoint and preview the part you need by adding better search options. Search filters enable you to identify and switch between sources. The selected parts can be previewed at the bottom of the panel and any available links and the component metadata. Adding parts is as easy as double clicking the component or simply drag the component into the schematic workspace. Components that have footprint variants can be expanded and preview, making it easier to choose a variant you require for your design. The new panel coupled with the new library manager interface, it's going to optimize your design with fewer steps and less guesswork. Since I mentioned the library manager, let me tell you more about it. Many of you have shared that existing library manager made it challenging to find the correct library and knowing the library source was not obvious. The new interface will optimize your design time with fewer steps and less guesswork whether the content is local or stored on the Autodesk cloud or shared through library.io. You ask us to make it obvious from whom the libraries were coming from and what did they contain before you installed them. Coupling these filters to identify the library origin and a more obvious update experience has cleared the way to a more productive and an enjoyable design experience. All this and more with Fusion 360.